you know, when we get sick, it's hard to tell sometimes if we need to go to the doctor or just write it out. And that's where Children's Health is stepping in with a new option, a virtual visit. And joining me to talk about it is Ken Dakin from Children's Health. Thanks for being here today. Absolutely. My Happy pleasure. to have you. Thank you. Uh, so let's talk about we've got flu that's going around, allergies. Um, I want to differentiate when you should check out an app or do something virtual versus, you know, maybe I really need to go in. Sure. Yeah, so we see a lot of patients that um, if they have comorbidities, let's say asthma, mm -hmm. they have some existing pulmonary condition or uh, maybe even a heart condition and they're experiencing symptoms such as a flu where um, they're having a lot more difficulty breathing okay. or they're having some heaviness on their chest and where the symptoms, they may present as the same as previous uh, episodes, but they may need to get checked out in that case. Whereas someone who's normally healthy and then they all of a sudden are hit with flu-like symptoms mm -hmm. like uh, fatigue and coughing, tiredness, fever, uh, body aches has been some of the big ones. Many times they can just go to, on to a virtual visit, which is kind of a newer uh, way to see patients yes, nowadays. Let's talk about this in this app and, and, and what it all does for people. It sounds very convenient. <laughs> it's super convenient. Uh, you can be seen from the comfort of your couch or your bed even at, at home. Um, not ever have to leave your the four walls of your house and you can have access to a provider that can examine Examine you, or that can uh, ask you a lot of different questions to help diagnose the, the kind of uh, malady that you may have. And I understand it can be different for children and adults. So how does that work? Yeah. So children, um, obviously, if they're really young, they don't know how to tell you the story of what they're feeling. So we'll converse with the parent to then ask them how how is a patient acting? Um, are they acting normally? Are they acting kind of it, different from what they normally are experiencing. And so a lot of times the behavior of the child will tell you if they're feeling better or if they're feeling well or mm -hmm. ill or not. And so it, uh, it all comes down to the story really. And then how is the patient or how is the parent just tuning into the, uh, the, care or, you know, the, the, the symptoms of their child. So is this that easy now that you can just download something like this in your app store and then, and it then really kind is. of upload yeah. and start working on it that way? So you can download, go to the app store, okay. download Children's Health Virtual Visit to your phone or to your laptop. And then literally within about 10 minutes, you just put in your demographics like you would at a normal clinic. Uh, you just fill in your, your, basic, your basic information um, and then you'll just you know fill out your symptoms that you're having and any past medical history that you may have or medicines and then usually within about 10 minutes you can see a provider maybe 10 minutes so yeah because normally a lot of people going oh man i've got to get off work i've got to schedule time or i got to pick up my child and you're in there right, for a long right. time people complain about that a lot absolutely and so it's really convenient even i've you know we've seen patients at their offices at their on their lunch hour you know if they're just you know hey i i have a pink eye or red eye or I have this cough or sore throat and they don't have time to get into a clinic before their primary care closes and so they can get onto an app and they can see a, 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 pay, or a doctor virtually. So it makes it really convenient. And even for parents with young kids, I think this is where it's really key is that they don't have to drag their entire family through a waiting room where they're exposing uh, their healthy children to a waiting room that may be full of other you know, sick patients. Absolutely. And then now all their healthy children that started off being healthy are now exposed, exposed. to a lot more germs. So well, this is a great idea um, and wonderful. So you can download that now. We thank you for coming on and sharing the information Absolutely. with us. Absolutely, my pleasure. Technology, you know, it is yes. great a lot of times. <laughs> just like in this case, thank you, appreciate it. Yes, absolutely. Uh,